Yeah, so Charlotte, we know the big match everyone wants mm -hmm. to talk about is Turkey. Eh? Do they have a chance to get through to the knockout stage or not? Well, I think all the Turkish fans will certainly hope so. But all they have to do is avoid defeat. And Vincenzo Montella will be looking at his squad whether he's going to start Ardigala. So a lot of questions surround uh, the manager. But we'll have all the details coming up next with Lance Santos, who's actually in Hamburg for us. So we'll have all the details next. Wednesday's European Championship action has kicked off with two matches in Group E to decide who goes through. And at half-time, it looks like Romania and Belgium will directly advance. Turkey have a destiny in their hands as they head into their final Euro 2024 group game against Czechia on Wednesday. And that's all we have time for on this week's edition of uh, Sport. So we'll throw back to you. Thank you again. So, Charlotte, just tell me one thing before you go. If Turkey manages to win this game, is it going to be absolute chaos in the streets of Istanbul or not? Oh, of course. I mean, everyone's going to be celebrating, particularly actually here in the studio, because we've got so many Turkish fans here with us. Well, let's hope that they win then. <laughs> Turkey have a destiny in their hands as they head into their final Euro 2024 group game against Czechia on Wednesday. Over at the Copa America, Argentina have confirmed their place in the quarterfinals. Messi's side left it. Boxing now and Alexander Usyk is undisputed heavyweight champ no more. That's after he vacated his IBS. British youngster Emma Raducanu enjoyed a rather easy day out on court at the Eastbourne International. The 20 year And that's the sport for now. Thanks for watching.